Pension benefits might soon be available to veterans over the age of 99. This after Representative Matt Gates introduced legislation to Congress. Channel 3's Rebecca Castor joins us now in studio with the latest on the Pensacola veteran who inspired this act. Rebecca. April this week, Channel 3 sat down with First Lieutenant Joseph Ainsworth, a 103-year-old veteran living in Pensacola. And like many vets, Ainsworth has been denied pension benefits from the VA because of his family's assets. Now, I looked into it, and under the current law, veterans with a net worth over $129,000 are not eligible to receive aid and assistant benefits. But with medical bills and the high price of assisted living, many older vets still struggle to make ends meet. Joseph Ainsworth is a World War II veteran. He tells us he was drafted to the U.S. Army in 1944 and sent to the Philippines right after President Harry Truman dropped the world's first atomic bomb. What does this legislation mean to you? Oh, the satisfaction there's something that has happened that is in favor of a veteran. Now at 103, Joseph's son tells us his father is still sharp just slightly hard of hearing. You know, the doctor says he could live to be 110. Steve and Joseph Ainsworth have been working with Congressman Matt Gates's office for several months to create legislation that will help older veterans. The Joseph Ainsworth Act, introduced in Congress this week, would change the net worth limitation for veterans older than 99 who would otherwise be eligible for pension payments. They can see a doctor more. They can have the drugs they need more. Well, they could have whatever they need. Steve tells us he's been applying for veteran benefits for his dad for months, but kept getting rejected. His father has too much money on paper, even though he has many high expenses. Now both father and son say this act is a prayer answered. It doesn't happen overnight sometimes. Sometimes it's like that. Other times... You wait and you wait and you wait, but the Lord never fails. In a press release on the act, Congressman Gates says eliminating this rule for our military heroes who have achieved such a milestone in their life will help alleviate financial burdens they may endure and also show our nation's gratitude for their selfless devotion to our country. Now to read the Joseph Ainsworth Act in its entirety and to find out if you or your loved one might be eligible, visit our website, WEARTV.com. In studio, Rebecca Castor, Channel 3 News.